Hi guys, this is Lars Pearson here at Marine Max in Ship Bottom, New Jersey, and we're standing on our brand new 2020 Sea Ray 250 SLX. Right now, I'm back on the swim platform. As you can see, there's a lot of space back here for when you're anchored up. Kids can hang out back here, you can hang out back here, and I'll get in and out of the water safely. There's a reboarding ladder tucked up under the swing platform as well. And uh, now back here, you got your sun pad. This actually lifts up here, and it's like a ratchet, so you can adjust it. You do backrest lounge out and pull it all the way up. It goes back down. As well as you got a 12 volt back here, you can charge things up or use it for you know tube pump um, to fill up any tubes you got out. Now walking up here, our transom walkthrough. We have a nice freshwater shower. Got storage under here that can also double as a cooler, so you don't have to get up in the boat to grab a drink when you're out hanging out. As well, you got a transom remote. So same concept. You can use all this stuff and not have to walk all the way up to the helm. Right here, so your switches for your tower. And then you also have a little boarding step, which is nice to get up on a high dock. So here we are in the spacious cockpit of this boat. As you can see, you got a nice wraparound seating, as well as I'll point out for 2020, they did come out with a new stone interior, which is a light gray, the darker gray mixed in, and it's coupled nice with the uh, snap-in gray sea deck they do. Real nice color packages on these boats. Now back here too, you also have a plug for your battery charger and then a table mount. So you can have a table out here, put food and drinks on it, hang out for the day and uh, enjoy a nice lunch. As well, you got the tower that I mentioned you have the switch for. So this actually lowers down if you need to go under a low bridge. Um, there will be canvas on this too as well. Now up at your helm, we got your twin Simrads on the glass dash they do. It'll do your mercury vessel view gauges. You got a Fusion Apollo system and then regular switching. Here at the helm seat, you have flip-up high-rise bolsters. This seat also swivels. You got a matching seat on the port side. No lock and glove box. You can throw a phone wallet in there if you're stopping off at a restaurant or something. So you don't have to take it in. Here on the port side too, I also have a spacious head compartment. Now I'll point out here as we walk up to the bow, the SLX series does have the nice stainless steel trim on the windshield. Let's have a wind door here, and then this glass closes, so on those chilly days, we keep a little warmer. Here in the bow, you do have some nice lounge seating, so you can sit out when you're running, or if you're just hanging out, anchored up somewhere, you do have flip-down armrests, which is nice. You just have storage under these seats. On the starboard side here, the storage actually goes all the way under your helm there, so it's actually a huge area to put some bags or any other things you want to store on the boat when you're out for the day. Another touch too up here is the stainless steel grab rails for safety. They actually wrap it in material, which is real nice. Makes it comfortable to hold on to. As well up here, so we have our anchor locker. Stainless steel cleats all around. Again, this was Lars Pearson with Marine Max here in Chip Bottom, New Jersey. And if you're interested in this boat or any other boat we have here, give us a call at 609-207-3325.